go. What is up, toy friends? And today, I might be doing my video with Lily, but if she don't run away, okay. Say hi, Lily. Say hi to the toy. Say hi to toy fans. <laughs> you look so tired of me. <laughs> it's doing random posts with my cat. Okay, now let's get started with the video because that was a very weird moment. <laughs> what are we doing today, Tommy? <laughs> we are going to be. Oh gosh! We are going to be opening a magic Mickey, and I also have this wand that comes with it. I'm super excited because it comes with a wand. Yay! And right now we have discovered the Magic Mixies spell book. And inside you're going to find the instructions. So we are going to have Johnny demonstrate this awesome toy and show you the contents that we have that we've discovered. So we have a little jar here with a number one and these nifty little things came in this little Magic Mixie Jewel box. And here you'll see we have number two, and we have number three oh, and four. Honey, oh, drop the number. Thank you. We have number five and six, and we have number seven. Okay, so it looks like we have everything we need. We even have this little bottle here. And we have, yeah, that, but we don't really know what that's for yet, but we may find out here soon. So, okay, Johnny. So what we're gonna do is fill the potion bottle with water and pour it into the cauldron. So let me go grab some water and we'll get started. Okay, we're back. Are you ready, Johnny? Yes. Okay, so start your potion. Fill potion bottle with water, pour into cauldron. Okay. We are using bottled water. Ooh, okay. All right, so we have the potion bottle filled with water. Listen for the tap, tap, tap sound. Hmm. Tap the cauldron three times. Okay, so we're going to pour this into the cauldron right here. Hold on. Okay, so Johnny's got the bottle full of water. We're gonna pour it into the cauldron. Ready? Not quite yet, hold on. There's a little thing down in here. Okay, go ahead and pour that in there. Oh, wow, did you hear that? That's so cool. It's really bubbling like a real cauldron. Tap it three times. Oh, that is so cool, toy fans. Okay, so now we're going to give your magic mixie its voice, okay? All right. Oh, there's the three taps. Okay, now it's, light, <laughs> really it's like lighting up this. inside. Look, that's so cool. Awesome. Okay, so pour in your sound dust, Johnny, and stir your potion. So we're giving our magic mixie its voice. Move your hands for just a second. Look at that. That is so cool. Listen for the tap, tap, tap. Now you tap your cauldron three times. Wow. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna add sparkle. It looks bright. It does. 
Now we're gonna add sparkle to your Magic Mixie's eyes. So number three, yes, let me get this. Lily, what's going on? <laughs> I don't drink it. <laughs> okay, so go ahead. Remember what they say, never drink a witch's potion. <laughs> what is this, hocus pocus? <laughs> so add some sparkle to your Mixie's eyes. So Johnny's opening up the sparkle. Oh look, they're little stars. Oh, a star. Okay. It just was broken a little piece. Oh, it's like a bath bomb. Drop in glimmer star. Stir your potion. Oh, Listen oh, for the tap, tap, tap sound. Now tap your cauldron three times. Wow. <laughs> okay, number four. Rancher Mixie its wings. Drop in the magic feather. Holy, what's going on? Is it a feather? <laughs> oh, cute. Okay. So you're going to drop your in your magic feather. You're going to stir your potion and listen for the tap, tap, tap sound. Start the star. You're Try tapping the cauldron three times. There you go. Wow. Okay, now five. Go to number five. Color your Mixie. So now we're going to color our Mixie by adding the Fizz Flower, labeled number five. Show us the Fizz Flower, Johnny. Oh, cute. Oh, and <laughs> there goes the fizz flower. Right okay, so you're going to drop in the fizz flower, stir oh. your potion. Oh, it's pink. Ooh, that might be an indication of what color your magic mix is. Well, didn't it say be. color my mixie? Yeah, so it looks like you're coloring your mixie pink. Listen for the tap, tap, tap sound. Oh, now tap your cauldron three times. Yes, this is number six. Okay, number six, add the creation crystal. Creation. Drop in the crystal gem. Let's see how we have pink cauldron juice. <laughs> Might okay. drink it afterwards. <laughs> so. Okay. Gem. So cute. Drop in the crystal gem. Stir your potion. And listen for the tap, tap, tap sound. It's changing colors. What, what, what are these cardboard things? I wouldn't touch them yet because I didn't say to remove them. They might become useful. I don't know. I'm just afraid to do a step that it didn't say. Okay, listen for the tap, tap, tap sound and then tap your cauldron three times. Number seven, now you're gonna name your Mixie, Johnny. Ooh. Write its name on the scroll and drop in the cauldron. So do we need a pen? You might need a pen. Good. Okay, Johnny's gonna go get a pen and go see what she names her magic mixie. We're back! Okay, Johnny, what did you name your magic mixie? I named my magic mixie. I think I accidentally put an E on what I was supposed to spell, but I put pinky. Oh, because she's gonna be pink. Oh. That's adorable. Now, real quick, parents, 
and toy fans. We did, in fact, take the little cardboard things off inside. It does not hurt our Magic Mixie potion or the, or the magic or the hidden magic mixie. So you can take those out, but you just need to do it very carefully so you don't move anything from inside. So, okay, so you've named your Magic Mixie, Johnny, so stir it in your potion. Okay. Listen for the tap, tap, tap sound, and then you know what to do. waiting for the tap, tap, tap sound. I think it's so cool how it makes cauldron, like bubbling, sizzling cauldron sound. Like pushing. <laughs> We're still waiting for the tap, tap. Can you wait, huh? Yeah, water. Gotta keep stirring. <laughs> Here, I'll, I'll stir. This is the hottest toy of the year. This is amazingly Woo! cool. I hear it. I hear it. It's little voice. How cool is that? <laughs> ah! <laughs> that is so cute, Pinky! Pinky! Oh my gosh, can you go ahead and take it out? Yeah. Does it just come out of there? Oh, I think it's just a twist. Twist? Okay. Let's see, hold on. It says, align the larger hole on the Mixie's back with the clip in the center of the cauldron. Oh, reveal your magic again. Sorry, that's if you want to. That's what's really cool about this, folks. You can do this more than one time. So you can continually reveal your magic mixie. It's not just a one-time thing. Um, but let me figure out how to get it out. Um, let me see. Let me help for just a minute. What do you think, Johnny? I love it. On a scale of one to ten, what would you rate this toy? One thousand infinity and beyond. <laughs> That is too cute. Okay, so it's showing the direction in which to twist. So, uh-oh, uh-oh. I got some cauldron juice on the carpet. Oops, Johnny warned me it was gonna be messy. It's not too bad messy. It does show on the instructions, though, how to empty your cauldron. So if you just follow the instructions, you won't have any problems. So you just have to twist like the directions show you to. I feel like there's a rubber band or something. Yeah, I saw that. Okay, yeah, go ahead and cut that, Johnny. So we're gonna get the scissors. Of course, you probably don't have to do this when you reveal it for a second time or more. Ooh, she found it. <laughs> so this, I imagine, can come off. Oh my gosh, look how cute that is. That is so cute. That is adorable. Well, hello, Pinky. Welcome to the family. 
Oh, she talks. So she talks and she toots. <laughs> Let's so just say cute. that. That is absolutely adorable. And I see on here. Look, the scissors. Oh, my gosh. Uh huh. I don't know. We will find out. Right now, I'm going to cut these plastic things off of here like this. And. She's a little bit wet from the push. Yeah, she can be. She's just, there's little bumps. So, on the instructions, folks, you twist this off and you can empty the magic mixing potion so that you can start over. But here it gives all the instructions and they seem pretty simple to follow. Wait, no, wait. What? I wonder how you start over though. There's a lot, oh, so, talks about each little thing, one through seven. So the cauldron has a sleep mode. You can refill it with mist. Oh, I think that's what that little bottle is. After using your cauldron a few times, the mist effect will be reduced. You can create more mist by refilling it with liquid found in the refill vial. Does that have liquid in it? Yes. Okay, that's the refill vial. So that, folks, is what you put in the cauldron if your mist starts to get a little, you know, if it diminishes. <laughs> um, if it doesn't work. Yeah. If it starts to go away, you have a refill vial. So ensure all water liquids have been drained from the cauldron and is in the reset position. Refer to emptying your cauldron and resetting your cauldron sections of this manual. So it clearly goes through everything. So make sure you don't throw these away. Mixy enchantment mode. Sit your mixie on the rim of the cauldron by threading its tail through one of the handles. It'll sit there and help you cast spells in the cauldron as it chatters and mumbles magic words. Oh my gosh, Wait, so cute. Try that. Try that. It says you intertwine its tail through the handle. You sit it on the side, so like, you set it. Oh, it's not a, got a nice, stiff tail so you can set your magic mixie here and wrap that around the handle. Okay. It's a strong tail. That must be why it leans like this so it can sit on the cauldron. Okay. I'm getting it going. Okay. Uh oh. Now I'll just hold it. I think she might stay. Go ahead and let go. There, okay. So, um, tap your wand on the Mixie's gem while it's in enchantment mode and you might get a surprise. You can bring your magic Mixie out of this mode by petting it. Enchantment mode. Sit your mixie on the rim of the oh, cauldron. It's sick. Yeah. So it has a gym right there, but like, do you like. Mm. Wait. Do you hit this one or this? No. Like this? It says it's gym. Oh. Okay, now tap its gym on its head. Or touch it to it. Maybe like the tip or something? Like. Oh, oh, that makes a difference, folks. Did you see that? Do it again. Okay. Do it again. So you have to make sure it hits flat up against this. Needs to be that part. Very cute. So you can nurture your magic mixie, pet your magic mixie just above its gem to build up its energy. So we're gonna pet it right here to build up its energy. Watch as the gym lights up and your magic mixie makes cheerful noises. The more you pet, the stronger and happier your mixie will become. Energy level. Your magic mixie has different energy levels that change depending on the way you interact. Its sounds and gym color will indicate the current energy level. So, 
magic using the wand, oh, depletes the energy. So each time you use its wand on it and it helps you like make spells, you kind of zap away its energy. So you gotta okay. give it, <laughs> you gotta give it more by petting it and nourishing, nourishing it. So petting and sleeping builds energy. How when much you're petting it's gonna be bouncing off the wall and you're like, <laughs> When your magic mixie is out of energy, it will not be able to perform magic anymore. Use nurturing to build its power back up again. So if the mood is weak, the gem color will be red. If the mood is medium, the gem color will be blue. And if the mood is strong, the gem color will be gold. Oh, it's strong. Okay. When you leave your magic mixie alone, it will, oh! Rough day. Just, <laughs> just, yeah, I had a rough day at work. Uh, coffee. Yay. <laughs> I wish I could do that. Fire. <laughs> oh, there's a little. Hey, I think it just farted back. <laughs> yeah. There's a little on and off mode switch too here on your magic mixie. So you can turn it on and off to save <laughs> oh, no. energy and batteries. So, when you leave it alone, it will regain its energy. If you continue to leave it alone, it will become tired and fall asleep completely. You can wake up your magic mixie at any time by pressing the on or off switch twice. So, this button right here twice. What do you think, Johnny? That was so cool. I enjoyed that so much. So, your magic mixie, three different magic responses to the wand. One quick tap is Mixy Spell Mode. Jim will turn purple. Two quick taps. Let me see your, your wand. I want to try this. Okay, ready? One quick tap. Jim will turn purple. Two quick taps. Mixy Wish Mode. Jim will turn green. Oh, oops. Turn green? Yeah. Oh, there. It turns green. And hold one to Jim for a few seconds and the Jim will strobe rainbow. Hold it on, wait. Hold it on now. Keep holding it on now. Can you do it to the side maybe? No, like to the side, like, like. See how they're holding it on here like that, like to the side. They're holding it like that on the side. No, like this. Like, no, wait, they're holding it like that. They're holding it like that. No, they're holding it like sideways, like down. Like that. Can you it says hold one to Jim for a few seconds. Mix the enchantment mode. Jim will strobe rainbow. Oh, is it doing it? How did it do it? It just went like. All different colors? No. Oh. It just like. Oh. Well, super cool. That was a lot of fun. So, how would you rate it, Johnny? On a scale of, excuse me, one to ten? Infinity and beyond. Like a thousand. Yeah, cool. That is so cool. Well, that is the Magic Mixie Magic Cauldron. Mm -hmm. Awesome toy, super cool, worth every penny to me. All right. Well, toy fans, we hope you enjoyed. Oh, there it goes. It didn't go rainbow, but I think it's going to come oh, okay. back. Hmm. I love how you can keep using it and it has smoke. Can we comes do it with again? a refill. That'll have to be for another YouTube channel or another YouTube video. What do you think? I love it. <laughs> awesome. 
Well, very cool. And then you can keep all of your stuff in your cute little jewel box. Super, super cute. So do we throw these away or just keep them? Um, I don't know. I think since there's nothing left in them, we're just gonna go ahead and throw them away. But maybe we'll have another YouTube video where we come back and use it a second time without all the extra stuff. And you can see how you can use it more than once. Okay, all right, Johnny. Well, thank you, toy fans, for joining us all. We had a lot of fun introducing you to Pinky and making Pinky. And we will see you next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on that notification bell. Later, toy fans.